Hi guys, it's Jasmine. I'm really sorry I haven't been on YouTube for a while. I've been really insanely busy with school. But here I am with a get ready with me video. I started off by moisturizing my face before I started the video. And then I applied my Wet n Wild um, matte primer. And I'm just applying some um, NYX eyeshadow primer. I have like pin curls in my hair in this video. They're like really big pin curls and I just use like um, duck bill clips to hold them in place. Um, now I'm going to apply my Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. Yeah, I'm just going to blend that with my fingers. Now I'm going to set my concealer with my airspun powder. And I'm just going to use a powder brush for that. I'm putting some on my nose as well because they put concealer on there. Now I'm going to use my Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons palette and I'm going to use this shade right here. It's like a very light brown shade on my crease. And I'm just using this Lux brush. I think that's what it's called. Luxy or Lux brush. It's like a <clears throat> it's a fluffy brush. Now I'm going to use this flat brush and I'm going to apply this shade molasses chip on my lid and on my brow bone. I'm using this um, kind of like thin fluffy brush and I'm using this shade called Bordeaux or Bordeaux so I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right. I'm gonna apply that shade like um, on the line of my crease if that makes any sense. I, I guess to give it some de definition. Then I'm just going to blend it out.
And now I'm going to use that mocha shade again, that light brown shade with that same little fluffy brush on the line of my crease. And then just kind of blend it a little bit more. And then I'm going to use that flat brush and use this shimmer, shimmery shade on my lid. It's a more light shimmery shade than the one I used. But then I'm going to use that same other shade that I used on my lid, on my brow bone, and just mix it together with that other shimmery shade. <clears throat> and then I'm just blending that some more with that fluffy brush sorry guys yeah you can't see and then I'm applying I think is the mocha shade the light brown shade like underneath my eye And then I'm also going to apply that on Bardu shade, that brown burgundy shade that I used on the line of my crease. I guess to just give it like a smoky effect. And I'm gonna use my eyeliner. I'm gonna apply, I'm gonna make a wing. like always I draw like a triangle and then I fill it in it's just like the easiest way for me to do my eyeliner I also want to thank um, all my subscribers because I recently hit like a thousand something subscribers I think and I want to thank all of you so much like that made me really happy I think it was like a month ago that I hit a thousand subscribers but yeah guys thank you so much for the support and love um, and I'm gonna try my best to make more videos when I can. Um, I'm planning on making a haul video soon from AliExpress and um, Shein. I think that's how you say that company's name. And probably some other stuff. I miss, I really miss making videos. I just. I get so tired, you know, from school, but yes, I'm going to make more time for that. Now I'm going to use um, this Lash Paradise, ma <clears throat> sorry, mascara, I think it's by L'Oreal. This mascara works really good, guys, it's just really clumpy, but it makes my lashes re look really big. But I'm just applying that on my lower lashes and my top lashes before I apply my false lashes. And 
and I have them in this cute container that I always keep my lashes in. I'm using um, the Velour Clear um, Eyelash Glue. I got it at Ulta. It was kind of pricey, but it's because I tried so many eyelash glues and like no matter which one I try, my eyes get very irritated. The Duo one especially, I hate that one. That one makes my eyes irritated like after like a few days or weeks. But so far I haven't had any problems with this one. Um, it's supposed to be latex free and I guess for sensitive eyes. And um, it lasts really long. It's like super sticky so it like stays on my eyes like all day. I don't know why I'm cleaning my lashes on camera. <laughs> Sorry guys but. Yeah, it's like a brush on glue, so that's like super convenient. I hate tube glues. They're like so messy. The one I was using before this was like a glue from the Swamp Me. It was called Star Glue and it ended up irritating my eyes like really bad. And I threw that away and it was like a tube. It was in a tube and it would make a mess all the time so that made it worse because then the other glue that spilled spilled all over my lashes and then it got on my eye and yeah it was just like bad. But yeah guys you should try this glue out it's a little bit more pricier but i'm okay with it because i just have really sensitive eyes and i just can't use like other glues unfortunately i'm just hoping that this glue doesn't irritate my eyes anytime soon because then i'm gonna be pissed off because it was like i think 10 or 14 bucks which i know is a lot but like i said i've tried like the cheap glues like um ardell um duo the kiss glues and they all have irritated my eyes and now I'm gonna apply my um, beauty mark that I always draw on on the left side of my face And then I just go over where I applied my eyelashes, you know, to cover up any glue that's showing. Oh, and if you guys are wondering, I got this cute mirror at Dollar Tree. They have other colors. I wish they had a purple one. I would have gotten it. Because I love purple. That's my favorite color. That's why my hair is purple. But... Yeah, guys, they have like a silver one, pink one, a blue one, and other colors. But I got black because black is another one of my favorite colors. But now I'm applying my um, Too Faced blush. I've had this blush since like forever. I should probably try a different blush. But I'm just applying that with my e.l.f. blush brush. It's an angled brush. And it was only like three bucks at like Walmart, I think. I mostly use like makeup that's like drugstore, but I also have like more high end makeup. But I just don't buy like makeup as often as other people do. Yeah. Um now I'm gonna apply my lipstick I think. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna apply these two colors. I'm gonna mix them together. I was trying to do like an ombre effect, but it came out like kinda different, but you can kinda see both of the colors.
I'm applying um the shade obsession. I think that's the one I applied first. No, actually, the first shade I applied was like a burgundy shade by Milani. And then I applied um, the obsession shade over it. Yeah, I applied the shade sugar first. I just lined my lips with that and then I put the shade Obsession on top and they're both from Milani Cosmetics. And I'm just trying to make it look like an ombre effect I guess. I'm just using a big fluffy brush to kind of blend them in together and I guess just make it look more blendy. And that's a finished look, guys. I'm just gonna apply some Wet n Wild Matte um, setting spray. It's a matte finish. It's super affordable and it works great for oily skin. And yeah, that's the finished look, guys. So now I'm going to be styling my hair. I'm just going to take out those duckbill clips and then brush out my curls. My hair was like super faded in this video guys so that's why if it looks bad I'm sorry. My regrowth looks really bad but I just dyed my hair now recently my friend dyed it for me so it looks better now but now I'm just running my fingers through it and I kind of got like big curls And I'm just brushing the curls out with a teasing brush from Goody that I got at Walmart for like three bucks. And just kind of like fixing it how I want it to look and my bangs I'm just brushing them out too and I'm just brushing it so I like the shape my hair is in
I didn't really know what look I was going for for my hair. I was just kind of like brushing it out and seeing what my hair wanted to do. But yeah, I didn't feel like teasing my bangs that day. I just kind of just brushed them out. And did like a cute little thing there. And then I'm going to use some pomade to kind of smooth out any flyaways. I should have done that beforehand because I think I fucked it up. <laughs> Now I'm just spraying it with my Suavecita hairspray all over. Sorry guys, I'm always making that face when I put my hairspray on. I don't know why, I'm so weird. My hand usually gets stained really bad every time I wash my hair or use hairspray because my hair gets like wet. It's annoying. <laughs> but yeah, it's what helps keep my hair stay in place. But yeah guys, this is the finished look. And now guys, this is my outfit. Um, my whole outfit is from AliExpress, Express, sorry, including my um, choker. I'll link down below um, to the seller I bought these items from. But I just got this really cute um leopard print skirt it was only like seven bucks and the top was like probably like ten bucks and it came with this cute heart belt and i'm just wearing some fishnets that i've owned already and the choker is also from aliexpress it was like a dollar and yeah guys here's another video of my outfit i just felt super cute that day so here's a better look at it and and my shoes are also from Aliexpress I bought them um, a long time ago they're just some like cute Mary Jane shoes with like a bow on them but thank you guys so much for watching